There are approximately 12 laws in Islam, 12 Imams who brought the Sharia or the law. Uh, and Muslim was in the, inclined towards the Sunni doctrine. Yes. So which one of the Imams out of the 12 would be most suitable to follow? After the revelation of Allah, Islam has given it this year? Yes. So <laughs> 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 you mean by yes? <laughs> Whereas the Muslim of Islam has given his decision that Imam Abu Hanifa is the best of all and he should be followed mostly. Where is the question left now? Of <laughs> following anyone else? No, uh, my, my meaning wasn't uh, that I should follow somebody else other than the Muslim of I wanted to get clear in my mind which of the 12 laws, Sharia, because in the present Muslim world, uh, there are In fact, there are four major schools of jurisprudence, yes. uh, and twelve of the, out of the twelve, the rest of eight are just minor ones, insignificant ones. The four major ones are Hanafi, Hanbali, Shafi, and Maliki, and they enjoy the greatest following all over the world. So of these, the Muslim of the Islam to Islam preferred Hanafi. But he said that if there is a verse of the Holy Quran which categorically opposes the Hanafi view, or a tradition which you come across which categorically opposes the Hanafi view, leave the Hanafi uh, view and accept the teachings of that verse or that tradition. And if you don't find anything there, and I have given a decision against the Hanfi ruling, then accept my decision and uh, reject the Hanfi ruling. And if there is a situation where you have to think, then the ulama of the mouth, in general principle, should get together and decide on that issue. But as a general principle, he uh, advised the community to follow the Hanfi law, where all these things are not present.